Hello Heroes! GoPro has released preliminary 4th quarter 2017 results and product changes in 2018. We found that they would going to reduce its global workforce by 250 employees. Nicholas Woodmull will reduce his 2018 cash compensation to $1. And finally, GoPro will exit aerial market and close Karma product. But what are the reasons of it? First of all, we should talk about Karma's price. In fact, the Karma is cheaper in United States than outside. You should pay 50% more if you want to buy the Karma in Germany. GoPro claimed the Karma reached the second market position in its price band in 2017. Maybe they talk about the USA, but not about Europe. It influences on sales. GoPro has expected more than they had got. Next and the main scene is technical issues. As we know, GoPro recalled about 2000 and 500 Karma drones in November 2016 because of technical issue. A lot of people found several problems such as unexpected crash because losing signal. Obviously GoPro should to improve the Karma drone, but in fact they haven't got enough money to do it. Finance is very important. GoPro expected that yearly income would be about 470 million dollars, but it amounted to 340 million dollars because sales were worse than expected. If Hero 5 Black has sold to expectation at its original 400 pricing, we wouldn't have had to change prices across all of our cameras, and we wouldn't have had to do a restructuring and we would have been able to continue investing in programs like our next generation Karma. But reality is reality. Moreover, in 2018 GoPro are going to reduce its workforce to 1000 employees and set Woodman's compensation to $1. That's a pity, but GoPro don't believe in rich sales and they can afford to make Karma's changes. In conclusion, GoPro don't produce Karma anymore after the 8th of January. They continue selling Karma till their reserve will be empty. Despite GoPro has decided to exit the drone arena, they will continue to offer full service regarding spare parts, updates and replacements indefinitely. GoPro is currently doing exactly the same also with absolute camera models and the Karma will be no exception. If you have any ideas why GoPro is exiting the drone arena, feel free to share them in comments. I will appreciate if you subscribe our channel. See you soon!